everybody, welcome back to Chenaki. Today I'm going to share with you one of my purchases from Paris. That is the fourth review from my Paris trip, my Europe trip that, that came from the brand MS. And I actually wasn't expecting buying anything from MS because I have so many disappointments when I was visiting many of the MS stores around Europe during this trip. So for example, I've been to the one in Barcelona, I've been to the one in Madrid, I've been to the one in Lisbon, and all of them just say that, sorry ma'am, no bags available. And even SLG, like small leather goods, they were also like nothing available. Yeah, so it is something like that. I think stocks were really, really low. Um, yeah, so anyway, it was a disappointment altogether and especially I know how tough it is in Paris when I was there in 2019 and especially now, um, throughout my entire trip, I tried even before I fly and even when I was there in Europe, I was trying the lottery system, the apartment system online and I couldn't get anything at all. So yeah, it's, it's just a very low hope that I could even buy anything from MS at all. So I was like, you know, spending my money on all other stuff, for example, like jewelries or like um, other brands like Louis Vuitton, Veracalo, everything else apart from MS because I thought that I couldn't um, get anything from MS. So on my final day in Paris, I was just looking around. I went to uh, George V and um, I wanted to find like a small letter good, like, you know, this new 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 snap wallet that was from um that is newly launched but apparently a lot of them don't have it and i was in george v and i went to that small letter good department but before going to the small letter good department you have to go through this like the person who's like you know taking care of the appointment so i go to her and i say that hey i want to look for this snap wallet do you have that and they were like oh um this actually comes with a strap so it's actually under the back of Back department, so you would have to get a back appointment. And I was like, no, I'm pretty sure this is under SLG. Yeah, because I know that if, if you guys can just go to like MS website, if anything is under the SLG, it's considered SLG. Like for example, under the wallet size, under the wallet size. So if for example, Kelly to go, constant to go, all these are considered SLG. So I don't like it if like you know they saw that this thing comes with a strap and they just tell you if you are a novice, if you're an amateur, and you would probably like you know be glided by them. And I was like, no, I'm pretty sure this is from this small letter goods department. And she directed me to the small letter goods department, like you know waiting for somebody to serve me. And of course, when somebody came, the usual thing they tell you that oh they don't have this. And I was like, oh you know what, I'm actually very keen in this micro picotin but i want it in the ostrich leather so this combo is something like i don't think it's popular at all like if you have it you will sell it to me kind of thing but um i mean they have it and they don't want to sell it to me so first of all it was a snap wallet and they told me they do a check and then they say that oh, we don't have this available I'm, i understand that because that's pretty new launch so they might have not have that stock available but the micro picotin ostrich i saw it on the display piece display items and yet they don't want to send, send that to me and they told me that um yes we have it and we can sell it to you if you have a bad appointment but if you don't have we can't sell it to you so yeah all the out of stuff i was like even for this because i know that this is really not a popular combo at all like first of all the micro size is not very popular among compared to the picotin lock 18 uh, which I shared in this video already and then Ostrich all the more is even not as popular because most people would want to pay extra for Ostrich you know people would do it for Croc or for, for Lizard but not so much for Ostrich not a lot of people like Ostrich but I personally love Ostrich a lot so yeah anyway so I, I was stuck there in George Street for quite long while waiting for someone to serve me and uh, eventually I left with nothing so I went to Louis Vuitton and I got my Neverfru BB and then after that, I was like, you know what, let me just try FSH, which is the flagship store. And I walk the long way from Champs-Elysees, George B, Champs-Elysees, and all the way down to FSH. So it was a long walk, but yeah, it's okay, it's fine. I mean, I was carrying all my purchases, so I was happy about it anyhow. And after that, when I reached um, uh, FSH, um, I went to the small leather good department, and I saw this. Da -da -da, this is even better than a snap wallet. I actually wanted this, but this has lower hope to get as compared to the snap wallet which not a lot of people know about yet, right? So this is the Shandong to go. This is one of the to go that I like very much as compared to the Kelly to go or the constant to go. I have no idea, it doesn't struck me at all. Um, I, I know for constant people think that it's a very good substitute for the constant bag 
But um, Constance has never been one of my liking yet as of now, so I'm not really keen in the Constance to go as well. But I have no idea why when this launched, uh, the Shandong to go, it just caught my eyes and I just love it. So they have this Shandong lock over here. Yeah, but anyway, just, just share about how I got it first, right? So I was there, I went to the small and the good department, and um, um, the lady was like, I'm not sure if I have it available. And I was like, oh really? I mean, not even want? I really, really want it. I've been wanting it for a long time. So she, she was like, have you tried it before in the boutique? I was like, no, this is my first time seeing it in real life. I saw it online and other things. It's really one of the things that I liked. Um, can you please help me to check? And then she get my passport detail. And thankfully, I have a purchase history in, in Paris or in Europe before. So they saw that I have multiple records, like, you know what, in George B, in um, the Sevier, that another Perry store and then in FSH as well and then on the Europe website as well so yeah anyway I was spending um, multiple it on multiple avenues so anyway she said let me check so she went back to the back store and got out the exact same piece that I pointed at but actually I don't want it to be in this classic gold color I I, ha I don't like because I already have a, a gold a gold Kelly Dupash back already so I don't want another gold one but anyhow she said that's the only one. Oh, because I, I saw another the the this color that is on display item, and I thought that I can have that one instead. That is not so um, classic. Classic. I like something like like that small seasonal color and kind of thing. But yeah, anyhow, I got this. It's better than nothing. So she said only one available, and I was like, okay, sure. Then I'll have that. I mean, it's it's better to get something than nothing, right? So yeah, and then I got this. So I was very happy and lucky to have this. So let's just go through about this bag. So it comes in accent leather and they have this Shandong closure here which I love. It works like the constant style of opening but not exactly. So for constant you actually remove this the middle part you click open and the, from the hitch you click the horizontal line and it pulls out right. So this one was that you push this thing in and you just open it like that. So it's so cool. Look at the hole here. I don't know why this just caught my liking. I like it very much. I like it on the interior is entirely like just one compartment and there's four card slots and like a slip pocket. And there's MS Paris made in France here. So yeah, this is actually a very simple bag. I like it very much. If you want to see what I can fit in the bag, I have it here, the photos, so you can see how it fits on the bag. You cannot put a lot of fat item in because your your sight is not that that wide you might not be able to fit very bulky item I the, but earpiece is fine earpiece can go in alright uh, with a little bit of like tightness but it's alright it's doable if you guys want to put a earpiece in it's fine yeah and all the thin stuff I mean I'm sure you don't need a card holder when there are really card slots there you can actually have like a bastia point first where you put your cash um, and necessary and a packet of tissues etc etc yeah not very big stuff and all those things so yeah anyhow I was lucky for my purchase history because it came from I don't know whether it's available to let me check to this is the only one <laughs> yeah so yeah it was I was really really lucky because I do see that they were like you know a lot of people they were like can I have this can I have that they were like no 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 we don't have that available I saw that a lot so yeah I mean I, I, I don't know whether is it really not available or or what but I do see a lot of people experiencing it throughout my entire trip yeah yeah so let's just see how it looks on me I do love it but I'm not gonna try it with this lovely strap here so because this strap yeah I, I mean I haven't wanted to use it yet so I just want to remain it brand new fresh new so this the strap is like that like just a hole and you plug it into the the, the bullet here and on this strap there is actually a part that has MS made in France here they actually uh, like chop it in, inside the leather. So yeah, there's two parts. And it was different from my Creek 16th um, strap, a little bit different. So first of all, the leathers are different. Second of all, um, this one actually came with like, a, there is a loop here. There's actually a loop here, but this one has no loop at all. It's just straight away through the hole. Yeah, but anyway, I'll photo here, you guys can see it clearly. Yeah, Kalai, I think that's about the same for this two strap. And I'm going to try it with this strap on the back. Um, it's just a very normal one, so 
let's just make it a very simple, simple mod peep. Yeah. Yeah, correct. So I just put it in and then just close it. And I think it's great as a clutch crossbody bag like this. I know some people don't actually like the width, uh, the length because it's too long and too wide. But I don't know why, I just love it. Yeah. So this is one of the purchases that I made and it actually cost um, 4050 euros um, in Paris and um, we have like 10% off um, from the tax rebate. But of course the 10% does not really mean 10% because when you get back in your credit card, you might minus some administrative fee here and there. Yep, so this is my very first purchase in MS. And my second purchase, I went up to the belt department and I got this, which is the Pop H15 um, in rose gold. It's literally in rose gold plated. It's really beautiful. The color is really, really beautiful and I love it. And I actually got the one in size 70. So they brought out two sizes to make a choice to try the 70 and the 75. And the 75 is too huge. <laughs> she said that I can even go down to 65. I was like, but I was like, okay, no, I'm, I'm just afraid that if I, if I, if I eat too much or whatever, <laughs> I better remain at um, size, um, size 75. So this is actually 75, and I was at, I'm at the shortest. I'm at the. The, the most inner hole, so it's like the tightest one. Yeah, and I so that I still have two more holes for like to, as a leeway to play with. Yeah, so I mean it looks I like it uh, as a waist belt, and if I want to put it on my hips, it is not doable. Um, the strap is too short for hips. I mean, so if you buy it, it, it depends on where you want to wear it as a waist belt or as a normal belt. So I want to wear it as a waist belt. So I got the size seventy five one. And it's it's really pretty and nice. So I love it. This is actually getting one and more, more and more popular nowadays. The Pop H uh, 615 belt. So and in Prey at Sun Laga. So if you guys are interested to get do get it quickly. This actually retail for 100, uh, 1250 in Singapore. Um, but in Paris it's only 660 euros before the tax refund. Yeah, so these are my two uh, two of my first purchases. Um, when I was in Paris and yeah and then I will do my big review um, in my next review next YouTube review um, on the big things that I scored when I was in FSH during the same trip yeah so this is all that I want to share thank you very much for watching channel B please share to like and subscribe to my channel thank you bye